Good afternoon, traders. It is Monday, March 31st, 2014. The U.S. stock market is closed. Hey, the quarter's over with. <laughs> I don't know. I think I'm happy. I think I'm happy. I'm glad to see this uh, month over with, the quarter over with. You know, we had some of the best trading this quarter that I've seen in a long time. We said also had some of the worst trading that I've seen. And uh, even though it was a negative day today, there is some things to cheer about. And that's that that really feels good. Uh, you know, we had over fifteen thousand dollars in open trade equity negative on Friday, and I had no positive expectations for that at all. I figured almost certain it was gonna go over twenty thousand, maybe twenty-five thousand, who knows? Didn't look good at all, just looked absolutely terrible. And we came in today and we ended up uh, doing better than cutting those losses by half. Better than half. So I was pretty pleased with that. We are carrying a tiny negative going into tomorrow, but it's just a few hundred dollars. So we're not going to worry about that. What I am happy about, however, is the Dow finally broke up, broke out above my uh, infamous, infamous red line and uh, held there very solidly. Looks real good and I am anticipating, um, you know, some continued solid movement and I'm, I'm certain we'll take out our all, 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 our all time highs in in the Dow Jones. Anyway, let, let's take a look at those charts. Okay, we're looking at the Dow Jones Industrial Average here and you know here's this line that this market has been trying for the better part of this month to get above this line and stay there and it, it was unable to. It got above it several times but it always came down and closed below it. Very disappointing and as long as it was doing that it just seems like the overall market was killing us. And today, and this is why I'm happy, um, we, we came in here today and the market shot up like it's been doing almost all month. We get this first 15 minute bar very strong and uh, it got up here and then it failed here and I thought, oh my God, here we go again. This is just more of the same stuff because, you know, it gets us into quite a bit of stuff here and then it fails. But it got down to the red line and it bounced and it bounced up here and it never really seriously challenged that red line again. And um, it closed not on its high, but it's pretty darn close to the high there. Dow ended up closing up 134 points. So, we're very happy with that. I'm happy with that. And I think this bodes well for uh, future trading. I'll show you just a few of our trades today. Uh, nothing too spectacular, but still some interesting trades. Yeah, I'll show you a couple nail-biting trades here we had. This is an ADEP, A-D-E-P, ADEP technology. And we had bought this on Friday, and then it had just really tanked and gone against us. And this was one of the very negative trades that was holding our open trade equity down on the close on Friday and it gapped up very nicely uh, this morning then it failed again I thought oh god here we go again but then it came back and <laughs> this is a nail biter I mean we ended up uh, making an adept when we got out here drum roll $150 positive but considering where this thing had been, that was a huge improvement, even though it was only $150. And then, of course, you know, it wasn't going to let me rest. It comes in here, and we got into it again, and we're holding um, probably about $100 in open trade on ADEPT. So this, is, this has been a nail-biting market for us, but at least it didn't kill us. Um, I'll show you here, we got... Here's another another uh, trade. This this was this worked out very nicely for us. This is in uh, Next Star Broadcasting Group. That's N X S T. And we had bought this on Friday. And this was one of the few trades on Friday that actually closed positive. 
but then it uh, it continued to climb some more today, and we um, we got out uh, that with a little over two thousand dollars in profits right here. But again, just like this other one, we get end up getting back in, so we're still long um, in X uh, in Next Star uh, Broadcasting Group. And finally, I'll show you uh, uh, a really nice trade we had here in Vips, which is this shop. And um, did this this one was really nice because we had gotten into this on Friday, and then it had really gone against us. And this was, uh, you know, we were holding at this at a substantial loss on the close on Friday and then it just really gaps up this morning and uh, looked like it was going to sell off and then it could rally again then it looked like it actually took out its low and that scared me I don't like to see lower lows and then it it they brought it back up so we're actually holding over $2,500 in this shop so we had some really nice trades today the market looks to me a lot more like it it's making a lot more sense to me now I uh, feel quite optimistic and um, I'm looking forward to uh, April being a decent month for us anyway that's the way it went today this is Trader Bob signing off I'll see you tomorrow on Tuesday